That was some finish, Anthony, wasn't it? A counter punch and uh, a night to remember for you as well. I think, I think that was my first touch as well. Uh, <laughs> yeah, um, but no, I've dreamt, I've dreamt of moments like this, scoring in the Champions League. Yeah. Um, obviously, on a big occasion like this against a top European team like Atletico Madrid, it's a, yeah, like I say, it's a dream come true. Um, but no, it's only first half. First half is gone now, and second half is in Old Trafford in a couple of weeks. So we've got to be ready for that. But you appreciate the situation you're in. For you're, sure. you're closing in on goal. You know what's at stake, but you kept you kept cool again. Yeah, like I told you the last time we spoke in, at Brentford, I told you how calm and cool I am. Um, whenever I get an opportunity for the club, I just want to repay the favour for the manager and um, just li um, leave nothing on the tank and give my 150 percent every time I step onto that pitch and you know just enjoy it. So he's got a lot of belief in you. He's th when he needs something, he throws you on it, and it's working for you, right? Um, now. I'm, I just do what I can do when I get on the pitch. Um, I always tell myself I want to. Be the best player on the pitch. Leave like leave like I'm the best player on the pitch. Um, but yeah, I appreciate the boss. You know, like I said before, every time he puts me on, I just want to repay the favour to him. This might be a bit harsh, but up to that point, I'm not sure if Manchester United deserved an equaliser in. But I suppose that's what European football is about, staying in the game. Yeah, you've got to stay in the game. Anything could happen. It's Champions League. It's the best club competition in the world. Um, anything could happen. You've got to be stay ready for a full 90 minutes. Um, obviously, we didn't play the best football in the first half. Um, then in the second half, with the substitutions that we made, I think we stepped up a bit. Yeah, you weren't getting through or behind for much of the first half and some of the seconds. What was the, what was the manager looking for? What was he trying to um, change? Well, he's said to me what I always do, like just make the defenders scared, um, running behind, um, and then when I get an opportunity, take it. You aren't making defenders scared. It's, it just changes the mood for the return at Old Trafford as well, doesn't uh, for it? For sure, for sure. I'm just, just wanted the, I wanted a good result for the fans um, because they travelled a long way, and hopefully the next the next leg at Old Trafford will be even better. Well done, thanks. Yeah, thanks so much, Seth.